uh, trial challenging the New York City Police Department's controversial stop-and-frisk policy opened Monday with testimony from young African-American men who say they've been stopped and searched without cause. For the next six weeks, Judge Shira Shinlin will hear arguments about whether the NYPD's practices are unconstitutional and unfairly target people of color. Nearly 90 percent of people stopped by police in 2011 were black and Latino, and 9 out of 10 were neither arrested nor ticketed. Plaintiffs in the class action suit are seeking changes to police practices, including a court-appointed monitor. Juan Cartagena, president of Latino Justice, spoke at a news conference outside the courthouse. Philadelphia is watching. Newark is watching us. Patterson, New Orleans, Chicago. Los Angeles, San Francisco. That's because policing, policing in urban America is on trial. Policing in urban America is at issue. Policing in how black and brown people are treated is on trial. Do not forget that what's happening in New York City by the NYPD is being watched closely by other police departments all over the country. Thanks so much for watching this report from Democracy Now!, your daily independent global news hour. We don't accept advertising or corporate funding, but rather rely on donations from viewers like you. Please make your contribution by visiting democracynow.org. We need your support today to keep bringing you this hard-hitting, in-depth reporting.